I don't know what's in Rush Limbaugh's heart, so I'm not going to comment on uh, uh, the sincerity of his apology. Uh, what I can comment on is the fact that uh, uh, all decent folks can agree uh, that the remarks that were made uh, don't have any place in the public discourse. And, uh, you know, the reason I called uh, Ms. Fluke is because uh, I thought about Malia and Sasha, and one of the things I want them to do uh, as they get older is to engage in issues they care about, even ones I may not agree with them on. I want them to be able to speak their mind in a civil and thoughtful way. Um, and I don't want them attacked uh, or, or called uh, horrible names because they're being good citizens. And I wanted uh, Sandra to know that uh, that I thought her parents should be proud of her uh, and that we want to send a message to all our young people that uh, being part of a democracy involves argument and disagreements and uh, debate, and we want you to be engaged, and there's a way to do it uh, that doesn't uh, uh, involve uh, you being uh, demeaned and insulted, uh, particularly when you're a private citizen. Women are going to make up their own mind in this election about who is advancing uh, the issues that they care most deeply about. One of the things I've learned being married to Michelle is I don't need to tell her what it is that she thinks is important. Uh, and you know, there are millions of strong women around the country uh, who are going to make their own determination about a whole range of issues. It's not going to be narrowly focused just on contraception. Uh, it's not going to be driven by one statement by one radio announcer. It is going to be driven by their view of what's most likely to make sure they can help support their families, make their mortgage payments, who's got a plan to ensure that middle class families are secure over the long term, what's most likely to result in their kids being able to get the education they need to compete. And uh, I believe that Democrats have a better story to tell to women about how we're going to solidify the middle class and grow this economy, make sure everybody got, has a fair shot, everybody's doing their fair share, and we got a, a fair set of rules of the road that everybody has to follow. Um, so uh, I'm not somebody who believes that women are going to be single-issue voters. They never have been. And, uh, but I do think that we've got a strong story to tell when it comes to women.